Hey guys, it's me, Drew. What up, it's Ken. And we're back with the more Club Penguin rewritten. And <laughs> yep, it's time to get medieval. So, there's lots of stuff to do on the island now. We're gonna go on a lot of quests today. Yes, we went through all the quests and show you uh, how they are. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. All right, so there's lots of free items. Well, actually, let's go to the town first. It's lot, the island has gone all medieval. It is amazing. And as you can see, medieval. Yes, the night, the night club. <laughs> that, that's just an amazing play on words there. It is an amazing play on words. <laughs> and so this is the catalog. There's cool stuff like this sword and these princess outfits. And it says, once thy book is this open, items of protection shall be given upon those trustworthy. Do notice, get rid of the book once open to cure the spell. One must defeat the dragons for a cured timeline. The secret to defeat the dragons is blank. Now, there are some free items we can get. We're going to start by going into the nightclub. The night club. And we're going to forge <laughs> our pen. Using the Pin Maker 3000. Pin Maker 3000. Woot, woot. And there, yeah, you got your pin. Now, uh, other free items. I know there's one. Is it in the forest? No, it's in the um the stadium. The stadium. At the jousting tournament. This is the squire outfit. And you can, right here, you can see kind of a jousting tournament about to happen. Yes. And so they're riding their horses. And so we've got I don't know if that should be watched. Nah, we've requested new milady. Yes. Alright, so we're going to the ski hill next. Ski hill. And there's this helmet you can get right here. And... Then you may go on the bridge this way. To defeat the mighty scorn. And get this cape. Which which I'm wearing right now. So it's very epic. And what Drew is wearing to me, I forgot. Now <laughs> before oh well typically fighting the main bad guy right on is not a good idea, so we must quest to Practice and journey to defeat the dragon. Woo! So we will come back here when we are stronger. But first, we must go to ye old um, mine. Hero's journey of Drew and Kendall begins right now. <clears throat> Enter all ye who dare. The Let's go. The one, two, and three. Which one, Drew? My lady, we shall go to quest one. Let's do it. So, quest one, you just gotta step on the lights. Very simple. It's extremely simple. Yep. Very simple. So, so simple. Unbelievably simple. I just walked through the invisible barrier. <laughs> that's supposed to like block you off, but you know, I, I guess not. <laughs> I don't know how to use that, but yay. Magic. All right. And now, once you step on all of the lights, um, the door oh, opens. Right yes. Uh, I'll, yeah, yes. Okay. Now, you want to I look. That. Sorry. Yeah, no, no, me too. You want to look at the signs before you get to the maze. So the fish is up and Klutzy is right. Klutzy, right <laughs> Klutzy the crab. <laughs> all right, now we go through. And then jellyfish right here. Yes. And Jellyfish is right and Boot is down. Now, there's also a free item over there you can get. I already have this item. So, you must work together with fellow knights to defeat the evil targets. Yes. <laughs> evil targets. 
evil thing. Why did I get punished at that? The evil targets. <laughs> there are 50 of these evil targets. We must defeat all 50. Yeah. There's too many of them. No, we got them. And we're done. Or oh, I am on my screen. Did you get up? Did you get them all? Oh yeah, definitely. Alright, so do you remember what was up, down, left, and right? Up, down, left, right. See? Up here. Boots. Jellyfish. Boots. Klutzy. Klutzy. And then a fish. So, I think it's down to go first. Also, here's another free item, Drew. Yes, the free item. Alright, so the boots. You can remember. I think it's down. Go down. I think it's left. Then, the yes, we did. Down again. Then, right. Then I think you go right again. Then you go up. And we've completed the first quest. Yep, and you get your free item there. The armor of armor. <laughs> the mighty armor. Ah. Now, for quest number two, we'll get a bit of dragon slaying experience. Heck yeah. So, well, this person already opened the door for me, but if you want to yep. open... But to open the door, if you haven't opened it before, you have to throw snowballs to... Um, each of the four torches and like extinguish it. I don't know why mine's not working. You gotta extinguish the fire. And yeah. then the door will open. Then you will have this puzzle right here. Hey, this. <laughs> it's the puzzles randomize each time. Yep. Sometimes it's harder than others. Uh, let's see if I can get this done in a efficient manner. Huh. This one's rather... Got it! Really? Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Oh, that I... was easy. I... So what does this one do? I do not know. Oh, does this randomize it? This one's not randomized it. I'm hitting the button, it's doing nothing. I don't know what that button does, then. Let us know in the comments what the button does. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Now, you can get your horse. And you ride your trusty steed. The trusty steed into battle. <laughs> now, this is the first dragon we shall slay in this video. Yes. So, you ready, Drew? After you, my lady. Alright. So... We're here, and in order to beat this dragon, you need to work together to fill up the snow. And you have to fill it up before he does his little fire attack, because they don't reset. So you throw snowballs up there, and the snowballs will fill the cannon up. And then once the cannon is full, you'll have a green button, and you will fire water at the dragon. Once you fire three water attacks from the cannon at the dragon, the dragon will be slayed. This is the easiest dragon of the dragons we will face. And boom. We already got him. Now, I just want to point out for clarity purposes that this guy is literally plugged up to something over here. And it would be a lot more efficient if we just simply removed the plug. But, you know, I guess that's not how this is going to work. Like, come on, that would have been the easiest thing to do. Just unplug it and bam, we're done. I mean, but no. I guess electricity didn't but exist back then. Exactly, it's 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 insane. <laughs> it's crazy. Man, In insane. It's crazy. And anyway, once you have defeated the dragon, you will get two rewards. The first is the toothbrush pen. Yay! And over hygiene. <laughs> 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 hygiene. <laughs> yes, the hygiene. And then okay. you can get the dragon's gold, which is a furniture item, as many times as you would like to get it. Yeah. 
usually for me, I get four of the free furniture items, but you can get as many as you want. As many as you want. Alright. So, the final quest before we fight the evil is we have to go fight the Hydra. Which, this one's kind of tricky. Very tricky. Now, this one you have to use your memorization abilities. So, uh, um, it, I, I, the thing is, I don't, I can't remember all three of them. I, if I knew which one I was supposed to like keep my eye on, I'd be able to keep my eye on it. So. Uh, I think the yellow gym. Wait, is the door already open for you? Yeah. But anyways, you use your memorization skills, basically. All right. Be off there, but anyways. For, for time sake purposes, we're going to skip this part. Yes. And now this one. Oh, you get your helmet the, right here. The helmet. Yes. That you have to step on the these little portals. And as you can see, there's some gates and then there's some... Then there are some, like, areas you can pass and there's areas that not. You can click the buttons and it changes where the gates are. So you keep clicking it till you... And I made it. So I think you hit red and then blue and then you walk all the way around and you hit yellow and then you're through. So it's... There's yeah, it's red, blue. Red, blue, red, yellow. yellow. All right. You basically don't touch the green. Yes. So. Yeah, uh, that's true. Yes, I'm through. Where are you? Oh. All right. So. And now you, you, gotta suit up you need the shield. You gotta suit up. I think actually just holding the shield blocks it. Yes. Okay. So now, if you look closely at these paintings, a shield blocks the rays from the yellow one. On this blue one over here, you but you drop like lava on it, and on the red one, you just simply um throw snowballs at it. Simple. So, you know this because we are now going to defeat the Hydra. Yes. Now, right, first? Uh, you throw red first. Now, if you get hit by its beams, you will be sent out of the room. So, watch the floor to see where he's going to fire his beams at. Alright, so... But actually, for the, the yellow one... Yeah. You, so for the yellow one, you want to actually, like, go to where he's shooting the beam so you can reflect it. Alright, so, first one is the red dragon where you just kill it with snowballs, and then yeah. you wait for it to rotate. So it's going to rotate pretty soon. Yep. Hmm. They're, they're getting yeah. kicked because they're letting them get hit with the dragon fire. Yeah, so, I've learned that because that happened to the both of us. Yes. Alright, see. Go, now, go, 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 throw it. Yes. Once it's, okay. once it's over the head, you throw the, so it drops the lava on okay, it. Okay, people stop hitting it now. It only has lava. Dang it. Because <sighs> Gotta see, hit. That's, that's a terrible thing, but it did. They stopped spamming snowballs. Get out of there. They get out of there. Move, 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 move. Oh, great. Did you get kicked? Yeah, I got kicked. Alright, so now you have to throw the snowballs. Alright, let's see. Okay. Still here. One more hit on the dragon should get it. Kendall, move, move, Kendall, move. Kendall, move. Huh? What? Did you get beat? On my screen, it looks like you got beat. No, I'm still here. Okay, I found. I, I didn't get here, the. Here. I didn't defeat the blue dragon. I still had to get uh -huh. one more hit on it. This time, you actually go in the where they're where, where he's going. Fire. Where he's in the fire. And See? Yes, and reflect the beams back at it. So that's how you get them. Yes, let's go. Come on, Come on we got it. Yeah. One more reflection. And I don't know why the blue dragon's not dead on my screen. It's very confusing. There we go. 
Alright. Now hopefully the blue one alternates so I can get the blue dragon before we go through unless the blue dragon's kinda like glitch. Hey Drew. Hey Ken. I'm over here. Save me, Drew. Oh no. I must defeat I'm, the Hydra. I'm trapped. Ah. I'm trapped. I gotta finish the Hydra. Okay, no, it all respawned. Never mind. It's glitched, but you you know how to be each Oh, I went through the door. Anyways. I alright. Kendall, I save you. <laughs> Even though I just did the room, <laughs> but uh, yeah. 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 So through this door, through the door is the last when the, the last free item you can get, and you get this awesome throne room. Hey. Now we've done all the quests. Now we will return to the mountain of danger. The mountain danger. And then we will walk across the bridge of destiny. Now, I'm going to show you how to beat the Dragon yeah, Queen. I'm again. Okay, so defeat the Dragon Queen. Uh, you gotta keep. So she has a couple phases. She will. Well, not really phases. She has a plan. She's gonna blow smoke and then she's gonna move. And once the smoke disperses, she's gonna. And she's in the spot. She is gonna fire a snowball. We're not snowball. We fire something. We're gonna fire fire or punt. Throw a punch. And you gotta make sure you're not hit by that. And then you get your snowballs in, and that's the process. So, right here. So, you blow smoke, and she's gonna stay right there for that first phase. I don't know why it's not letting me throw. It's just ah, uh, what the ah. Uh, Okay, it wasn't letting me throw snowballs, but in order, to, there's a lot of questions on how to move. You want to click the bottom of your screen and move. And then while she's attacking, throw snowballs and keep throwing snowballs until she blows smoke. Then you can't throw snowballs anymore. Now, I'd be, I'd be all right. While she's at the smoke, I would start clicking your next destination because you need to move. Because sometimes, sometimes she attacks faster than she you know, gives you time to react for it. So, what, you gotta keep, you have three lives. If you get you three times, then you die, and the quest is over. So, I, I gotta move, I gotta move, and throw snowballs until she blows the smoke again. And it's just a long, just rinse and repeat till you, till you have defeated her. Sometimes she'll throw a punch, but if you move before, if you, if you start hitting the bottom of your screen, and I think you can see my mouse on my screen. Then you be able to. You should be fine. You should be able to beat the Dragon Queen. So there's the punch. I don't. I lost on my first try because I apparently didn't know I was supposed to hit the bottom. But I did know. I just forgot. I was supposed to hit the bottom of the screen when moving. <laughs> yes, it took me four tries to actually beat the dragon on the first attempt. Four. four. Not nah, four attempts, yes. I got two. Because Drew told me. Yeah. Yes, I've seen a lot of people be confused on how to do this, so this video is going to help you. Definitely, and now, I'll be here for commentary because I've already done it and I'm not doing it again. Yeah, she, she, she went for the smoke two times in a row, which I've never seen happen. Yeah, she does that. I did not know that. But move, 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 move. She went for smoke again. It's just... It's crazy. Yes, but this is long. It's a bit of a grind, but if you do this, you will not die. You do not want to get hit, hit three times, or you will have to restart. You have a life. Huh? Is that why I like hit them away? You hit it three times. What? Never mind. I'm confused. You mean like for scorn? Yes. 
Scorn, you don't have a life bar. I don't think you can die to Scorn. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but I don't think you can actually die to Scorn. No, I don't think you can. I thought you were talking about when you, like, hit them away, which you'll see earlier. But I was wondering, like... Yes. Because I thought you said me hit three times and then I hit him away. No, I'm talking about if you get hit three times by the Queen's attacks, you will die. Yeah, 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 now I know. No, you're fine. I'm so, confused myself. Alright, so now we've defeated the Dragon Queen, and here is Scorn. I do not think you can die to him, but the plan is you want to hit the bubbles that come up from the bottom of the screen. Which, I, I think if it's over his body... Can you hit if it's up, off the body? Okay, just as long as you hit these bubbles, then you damage him. And the bubbles are coins. And I think depending on how good the shot is, then the more coins you get. Like I get the purple one. The purple ones cost more. Yeah, my screen is lagging like crazy, but I don't think you can actually die to Scorn. But he doesn't fight back. He eventually breaks the cliff you're under, but I don't know if that's like a time limit thing. But this, he, the Dragon Queen is somewhat difficult. This is not difficult. This is just coins. Basically. And he will, he, like, like Kendall said, he will blow the bubbles away. Yeah. He's just, he's just so angry at bubbles. Yes. He dies to bubbles. Like a big powerful dragon, he's so angry at bubbles. Bubbles. I mean, like, come on, he can just, he's like popping. He's gonna be popping. <laughs> yes, we are popping them. Rower. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's just a rare. Rare. <laughs> hey, yeah, but I think the purple ones give you more coins. Yes, they do. Those definitely give you more coins. They're forty, forty coins. Yes. Sometimes it pop. It, there's random numbers on the screen. I, I don't really know. Just. Just, just, just defeat Scorn before he destroys your cliff. That's, that, that's the whole point, just defeat Scorn. Just defeat Scorn, which I have just done. And when you defeat Scorn, you are done with all the content until week two. And you get coins. I got 716? Uh, first time I did, I got like 800, but, uh... I got 786. Yes, and when you defeat Scorn, you get this background. It's the last free item. Anyway, at a long and arduous quest, Drew and Kendall have defeated four dragons, and we're going to the cove of the party, I guess. Woo! Let's go have a feast. Beach party! Beach party. So, yeah. this is a long episode. We, we are aware of that. But, uh... Remember guys, if you liked the video, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to join the family. And we will see you guys next time. Bye guys! Bye!